Hey guys, Brita here. Welcome back to Police Simulator Patrol Officers. Here we are for another highway expansion DLC look before the release on June 18th. Um, so you guys are aware the game will be out then. It'll be $29.50 Australian, so you'll have to convert that to your own income. But I guess what I would say to you guys is head to the Steam page, have a look at your currency how much is going to cost you? Currently 10% off, which the promotion ends the 12th of July, which may be 11th of July for you guys. But um, for you guys that are new and have may have not seen me play this yet, this is an early access press release. It will have bugs. It will have issues that will be fixed between now and release for you guys. So um, a lot of guys have been saying, how come you've got access already? It's DLC. It's not even out yet. Well, some of us content creators who have put a lot of time into Police Sim have been sent a key to check it out and to showcase it for you guys. So if you guys are um, a content creator who wants to check it out early, I suggest you head to their Discord and send them a message um, or flick an email through to Astragon. But anyway, let's head to Brighton Eye Patrol. We'll do another 35-minute patrol. And we'll start our shift. We'll go out in maybe, we might go out in the Charger this time. We've gone out in the old Highway Patrol car as well as the, ooh, what's it called? E EPV? I think, oh, I can't remember what they're called now. There's so many different names for the vehicles. Um, Recently, we've been receiving a lot of complaints about cars driving too fast. Maybe you can pay right, special These guys here with their little um, tie thing on the front. But let's head on out in the charger as you can see here Brighton Police we might actually have to go in to the garage make sure we've got the stuff we need in the boot so make sure we've got the, the stuff that we need in the back um, we're gonna need spike strips we're gonna need things like that so um, can we go change skin yellow lion skins we've got the Brighton Police black which will go with the black. I like the black. Let's go next tab. Road flares, traffic cones, evidence markers. We don't need evidence markers. Uh, don't. We do need traffic barriers. We're going to need a spike strip and also fire extinguisher just in case. Um, I don't think I've actually. I haven't actually had a fire yet, but I do know they are actually in the game. Potential fires we're going to have to put out with um with a fire extinguisher and that sort of thing. So. Right, let's head out onto the highway. Let's see what sort of trouble we can find. Now, I'm not a professional at this game. I'm not the best at this game. I'll probably suck at this game. I get a lot of things wrong. Oh, Jesus. I get a lot of these things wrong. And honestly, it is what it is. Uh, way Station Duty will take that. That guy actually there is drinking, drink driving. Um, yeah, I don't get everything right. I do get things wrong. I'm not perfect, I do apologise, but some people just are a bit over the top with their comments. This guy's been drinking too. Um, as I said, I'm not perfect. I make mistakes. It is what it is. Um, if Instead of having a go at me for getting something wrong and saying, why have you got early access because you're not even good at the game, you shit, blah, blah, blah. How about you, instead of being negative, how about you be positive and actually help someone out and say, you know, this is... What you did wrong, you should have done this, etc., etc. You know, let's help each other out, give each other some hints and tips and that sort of thing. I don't think being Mr. Negative and being a smartass really helps anybody. Anyway, let's get back to the game. Um, so far, the game is been awesome. I know there's a few things they're gonna have to try and fix between now and um, release. There's another drink driver. Um, you know, let's put our lights and sirens on. Let's head there as quick as we can. Um, there's a lot of breakdowns and stuff that seem to be happening on the side of the freeway, which is a bit over the top. I think they need to reduce those a little bit. Um, other than that, like it's been pretty good. The spike strip thing, I still haven't got that right yet. Pit maneuvers work really, really well. That um, vehicle back there, the SUV that I showed you guys, that actually does the tire, the tire grappler thing, works really, really well. Um, Spikes having somebody hit the spike strips, which I think I did somebody oh, I think I did a pit maneuver and their tires went flat. Um, and then you draw the gun on them, they get out of the car and they surrender. That works really, really well. I'm hoping long term there's going to be the ability to um, have shootouts with people. I think that would be awesome. 
Um, I just don't know how long it's going to take to get to that point. But I would like to see Police Simulator expand into fire. Fire trucks, ambulances, and that sort of stuff, and have it. So we've actually got people working side by side. Some people, you know, being police officers, just like we are. Some people being um, firefighters. Some people being ambulance people, paramedics. That would be pretty cool, I think. I don't think um, it'll happen in this version of the game, but maybe long term, the guys that develop this can look at expanding into something that covers all three. I think that'll be bloody awesome. All right, so as far as this goes, I'm not perfect at this. Let's go and do highway. Let's look at way station services. So state the reason, verify the truck, ex truck exceeds the weight limit. I don't know what the weight limit actually is. Confirm. Um, okay, 60. 60, 60 it is. Um, if everything is in order, the truck should obviously be dismissed to allow for another driver to drive on the scale. There are several way stations on the highway. Blah, 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 blah. Um, the driver's identity and their driver's license. Verify the information on the electronic logging device. Check the driver is under influence of alcohol and drugs. If driver displays unusual behaviour, the documents contain contradictory information. The officer in charge has reasonable suspicion to investigate further. Search a cargo and compare its contents with a shipping list on the ELD. Alright, so 60, 60. So that guy's over the limit. Way over. Alright, let's um, interact with you. Right, let's go talk. Driver. I need to verify your data and documents. This guy's been cooperate. drinking for sure. Okay. Let's get this over with. He looks a bit drunk. Uh, ask for documents. Actually, let's go exit the vehicle. Please exit the vehicle and step to the sidewalk. Not even going to muck around with this guy, to be honest. We're still going to ask him for ID. Don't go too far. Ask for documents. So ID we'll and insurance. And vehicle registration. Yes, officer. There you go. Right, so I don't know if this is his vehicle or not. That's the thing. 2025, 2022, so it's expired. Insurance is expired. 2LB, so that's, yeah, so it's expired. Expired insurance. So if I go bang, truck, expired. Well, there's no ex insurance. Commercial driver, driver, about, uh, there's no insurance valid for this. Do I just do it against him? I'm charging you for not yep, having valid insurance. Why does it cost so much? I was worried that it was going to go um, against I'm against me then. A sample to see if you've been drinking and driving. Right, we're going to check him for this, which he should be over the limit. He is. He's double the limit. Right, we're going to check his ELD after a drug test as well. Nope, he's good. Let's get his ELD. Logging device in the vehicle's cargo information, please. Ah, uh, yes, uh, the logging device. Here, sir. All right. Uh, time to break, so he's not over his break. Bus ticket, USB, spray can, and gum. I want to actually just go straight away. I'm going to arrest for narcotics, DUI, alcohol. I'm putting you in handcuffs now. Then please step onto the sidewalk. Please, officer. But I want to quickly search him. And then I'll search the truck as well. No, not you. Uh, search Please driver. For a search procedure. Right, disable call outs just in case we get another one. Uh, he's got a handgun as well. Wow, has he actually got no gun permit? Liability reason, weapon, handgun. I'm going to handcuff you now. After that, Please move to the sidewalk. What? Wow, can't believe he's got a handgun. All right, interact. Let's go search. That's cool. Actually climbs up into the truck. That's really good. Nothing else there. Let's have a look in the back. All right. USB spray can. I don't know if it's exact numbers. I wish it would actually go green if it was the exact number. Because I'm not going to check. I'm not going to be able to remember like if you press seed around the computer, I'm not going to remember exactly how much is supposed to be in there. Um, Alright, so let's go 
Uh, that's all we need in it. Yeah, call us transport. To take a suspect into custody. Understood. We're sending the closest transport to your location. All right, and then we'll go tow truck. I have a vehicle here that needs towing. I need a wrecker at my current location, please. All tow trucks are on call at the moment. We'll send one to your location as soon as possible. Right, no insurance. Uh, way station checkpoint. Your data and documents. Hey, Please cooperate. Okay. Let's get this over with. All right, we'll get him out of the vehicle. Out of your car and move to the sidewalk, please. So no insurance. He's a tow as well. Let's go. ID. Driver's license and insurance card, please. Yeah. And because Girl. he's he's showing that he's anxious and nervous, we can actually um. Get no insurance. Pretty sure we can actually search him as well. He's got a gun permit, which is fine. I'm charging you for not having valid insurance. Why does it cost so much? Right, DUI. Both tests. And he's obviously drugs. overweight as well, because it's 60. 60060. So 60060. He's the number, so he's definitely over drugs. the weight limit. No, no drugs. Let's go with a quick um, DLD. Vehicle's cargo information, please. Yes, I have it right here, officer. Right, so he's not over hours. Banana tires, keys, matchbooks. Give back. Can I actually go um, handcuffing? No, okay. Violation truck. Oh, no, commercial driver, overweight. I have to find you for driving a truck exceeding the legal maximum weight. The cost will depend on the distance you drove. Interesting. All right, let's quickly search. I don't know if I can search the front of the truck, but I can search here. Yeah, because he's got no insurance, we should be able to tow this as well. Oh, he's fleeing. Where is he going? Definitely got something legal in the back. Uh, can I get me taser out? No, wrong one. Police! Stop! Alright. Can't believe he's fleeing. I don't know he found in the back. Please! Don't shoot me, officer! Alright, let's go handcuff fleeing. I'm going to cuff you now. Please then move to the sidewalk. What? Can't believe he's running. Wow. Alright, let's um escort him back. Go escort. I'm escorting you to the police precinct. Right, all these other guys are gonna have to wait now. Sorry guys, you're just 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 gonna have to wait. Right, let's grab a quick screenshot. I like to um take screenshots of obviously in game stuff and put it as my thumbnail. I'm not gonna fake anything. What I what you see in the thumbnail is what I've done in the game or what you'll see in the game. I'm not gonna go and do any fake bloody <sighs> thumbnails like some people do when they um make content and make thumbnails, that really drives me nuts when people do that, but anyway. Alright, so we'll sit him right here. We'll go and check the back again and see what was actually in there. Search. So he's, if you, he's overweight. Animal fur, okay. I'm assuming animal fur is illegal. Alright, let's go. Search vehicle. I don't think we can do anything. Didn't even come up then. Can't search the engine bay. He's going to get done for transporting illegal goods. We're going to have to search him as well. And a switchblade. Bang. Let's go. Liability. Weapon. Switchblade. Transporting illegal goods. Animal fur. You've committed Charge those crime. as well. You're being arrested. Cooperate and move to the sidewalk. So somebody also so asked me how to actions. add multiple things. I didn't know that all those actions were illegal. So what you need to do is go into liability reasons. Let's go background document checks, and you can see down the bottom it says, says E select violation, or right mouse is back. So you can either select the violation, which will add it to the list on the right, or your left mouse click and it'll just charge them straight away, or right to go back. So depending on what you're actually playing on in console, etc., just look at your tool tips down the bottom. That'll help you guys I out. Have to search you. Kindly cooperate with me. Alright, so hopefully I can still get this guy 
to be transported. He's got a hand gun. He has got um he's got a gun permit, so that's fine. Multiple switchblades, though. Call the rest backup transport. To take a suspect into custody. I repeat, backup requested. Copy that. The Crazy. Unit will be sent to your current location. Can't believe he took off. Well, I understand why, I but have a car here that needs towing. Multiple switchblades. My current location. He's got a gun on him, which he's allowed to have. But animal fur as well. we'll right, 60. Oh, 060. So this guy's actually overweight as well. Talk, driver. For this routine check, I need your cooperation. I'm already late. Please, keep it short. You're going to be even later. Exit vehicle. I don't know if... Ah, does this pause when we do this? Let's go away station service. Uh, it doesn't say anything about if it's overweight. If it's overweight... If it's overweight, um, ID and if available. Can we tow it as well, or do we just let them go with it being overweight? They just get a fine for however long they're going to drive. So you're good, you're good. Let's check that. Open warrant. Interesting. All right, let's do his ELD. Please show me the logging device and your vehicle's cargo information. Yes, I have it right here, officer. He's got an open warrant. All right, give that back. It's only really seeing illegal stuff in the back. I don't think it matters if they mismatch. They got like one fidget spinner, two less, or whatever it may be. Point oh three. I really think driving a truck should be point zero zero. Pretty sure here in Australia it is. It's you got to have no alcohol in the system at all. Uh, let's go handcuff. Uh, Background, open I'm warrants. You now. Please then move to the sidewalk. Please, no. Alright, so I want to search him. We've still got to get him for overweight as well. I have to search you. Kindly cooperate with me. Alright, what's he got? Ninja Star, that's fine. Uh, issue violation, commercial driver, overweight. Your truck's weight is exceeding the legal maximum. You will be given a ticket with the fine depending on your travel distance. Right. Sounds really angry. Didn't even say anything. Right, so this is probably going to be an episode full of just, um... Way station check. Pocket knife's fine as well. See, here in Australia, I'm pretty sure it's a uh, Ninja Star switchblade. Even a pocket knife is illegal to carry. Got a switchblade as well. That's going to add another charge. Anything else? Yep, stolen bag. Wow, okay, so switchblade, stolen goods, liability, weapon, switchblade, uh, stolen goods. The reason why you're under arrest is because what? you have committed multiple felonies. Please step to the sidewalk. Did you plant evidence to arrest me? I didn't do all that. That, I'm pretty sure that was... It was stolen goods. Why did that not allow me to... I don't know what I got wrong then. Was it the switch... It wasn't a switchblade. But there's definitely stolen goods in there. Stolen bag. And the switchblade in the truck. Yeah, I don't know. I have a car here that needs towing. Please send a tow truck backup to my current location. To take a suspect into custody. No I repeat, backup requested. Hand. We'll Alright, well that's that's three from three at the moment. You're underweight, you're lucky. Alright, check your license plate. Uh no insurance as well, bloody hell mate. I'll soon be at your location. The March, January, February, March. So you nearly license plate's nearly expired. For this I think this guy's drunk too. Bloody hell, this is a this could be four in a row here. I'd like you to leave your car and go to the sidewalk. Oh, so no insurance is going to be a big thing. I'd like to see your ID and car insurance, please. Here you go, officer. Well, I didn't expect to be doing this the whole episode. Press I. What did we actually get wrong?
That's I wish it would tell us what it actually was wrong. ID is good. Insurance is out. Alright, so let's first of all, let's just go driver, valid insurance. We'll charge him for that straight away. I don't have that much money. Then we'll do the DUI right. test. Drug and alcohol. To check if you had any alcohol while driving. Over the limit as well. Do his drugs. I'm just collecting a sample to see if you used any drugs while driving. Hope he's good. I want to get his ELD. I need to see and verify your logging device. Please hand it over. Sure. Here you have it. All right. So is he over time? No, he's good. Looks pretty good there. All right. Quickly check the back and get ready in case he does try and run. No, he's not running, that's good. So he's going to get done for being drunk. No, he's good there. All right. Going to arrest him for DUI alcohol. I'm going to cuff you now. Please then move to the sidewalk. Please, don't do that. And we'll quickly search him. Search the truck. Kindly and then we'll um, get him towed. And also... Get him towed, get the truck towed, get him taken away. Got a handgun. Has he got a license for that? No, okay. So weapon, handgun. You now. After that I want you to move to the sidewalk. Please don't do that. Right, let's quickly check the truck. Watch your head, mate. Smack him in the back of the head with the door. Lots of stuff in there, but nothing to charge him for. No, oh, he's pretty good. All right, let's go. I need Rest transport. To take a subject into custody. Understood. The closest available unit will be dispatched to your location. So that's. I have a vehicle here for towing. What's that? that's Can four? Tow truck to One, two, location? three, four. We have got two to go. No tow truck is currently You're available. overweight. We'll send one You're to good. As soon as it's Unbelievable. You, You're still pretty good. Look okay at the moment, other than being overweight. For this routine check, I need your cooperation. Sure, officer. How can I cooperate? I wonder what happens if he stays in the truck and there's something found in the back. Will he drive off in the truck or what? All right, let's go. Show me your ID. ID insurance, and we'll get his ELD as well. I don't think he's got any drugs or alcohol in his system, but we will test him for that anyway, just as a standard thing. Yep, that looks all pretty good. Let's go DUI. All right, I'm just collecting a sample to check if you had any alcohol while driving. I probably don't look at the ID close enough, like looking at the person's photo and that sort of thing, and the I'm name. I'm collecting a sample to see if you used any drugs while the driving. The name matches the actual registration on the truck, but all right. So yeah, that's all fine. All right, let's get his. I need to ELD. See verify your logging device. Please hand it over. Sure. Here you have it. He's not acting nervous or anything, so he's pretty good. He leads you for a break. Satin gloves, cucumbers, old papers, and spray cans. All right. Hopefully he doesn't try and take off on us. We'll check the back quickly. All, right, all good. Did I? I don't think I charged him for being overweight yet, did I? Your truck's weight is exceeding the legal maximum. You will be given a ticket with the fine depending on your travel distance. Right, oh, everything else was good, wasn't it? Um. So, dro what does a driving ban do? Should I do a driving ban just in case, or just let him go? Because he's overweight. No, just let him go. Let him go. I don't know. If you guys know if we should do a driving ban, let me know. But I think he's okay. Right, you're underweight as well. You're good. Just check. Everything he's got access to a gun. That's fine. Oh, wrong one. Driver. I need to verify your data and documents. Please cooperate. Looks like he may be on some drugs, I believe. Out of your car and move to the sidewalk, please. Seems to be 
a little bit shaky. Show me your driver's license and if available. Is dial is all is yeah. pupils sure. are dilated too? Maybe it's hard to see. 2025, 2025. Yep. Okay, let's do. I'm just taking alcohol and then a drug test. Drinking and driving. Point oh seven. He's so close to the limit. You'll take a test. This is where it should be different for driving trucks. No, he's not. That's what. That must be why he's all over the place. Let me look for. Uh, no, back felonies. Uh, traffic violations. Doesn't say anything about, um... Yeah, it doesn't say anything there about if trucks are different. Logging device in the vehicle's cargo information, please. Certainly. I would Here think that trucks would be a little bit lower for drugs and alcohol, but... Right, plastic chocolate spray can, etc, etc. Right, he's all good at the moment. He's so close to being over the limit, though, so... He's not running, which is good to see. Ah, he looks pretty. He looks pretty good. He's lucky. Have a good day, sir. Everything's fine. You're good to go. Bye. The only one that really concerned me then was the one that was overweight that we let go. Obviously, he's going to be fine for that for the distance travelled. But here in Australia, I'm pretty sure if um, you're overweight. At a way station, you're not allowed to go. You've got to get the weight off the truck before you can go, which I've actually been caught overweight once um, driving a truck, which I didn't load. I didn't get in trouble for it, and they actually let me continue to go because there's no way I could actually unload it, and I wasn't over by much anyway, but... Um, yeah, so I've been overweight once while driving truck. I can't... It's so annoying that when you get in the, the car, sometimes the blinkers don't work. Yeah, I don't get it. It's annoying. Right, so that was, was that five? No, four out of six were arrested. Four trucks towed, four out of six arrested. That's pretty bloody good. All in a day's work. Right, I'd love to drive on this view, but I feel like we need to be a bit further back. I wish they um, did adjust the cameras a little bit better. I'm going to cut this guy off and move over straight, oh, straight away. So what's that there? That looks like a fuel station or something? Yeah, fuel station. Right, so we'll just cruise along here. See if we get another call out. That taxi, this, we might be speeding, not by much, but... So there's a bit of roadworks in the middle of the road here. you just got to be really careful with the AI at the moment. I don't know if they're going to fix it or what's going to happen, but they seem to just want to change lanes whenever the hell they want. I feel like this taxi is really speeding. This guy here is... Drink driving. Alright. Find a stolen vehicle. Sorry, lights and sirens on. Get out of the way, people. No one's moving over at all. Get out of the way. Thank you. So it's Dawn Babic, dark red Ford. Oh, fucking hell! That's what I mean. It this AI is shit at sometimes. Uh, 2BSG07. Right, so a few people have asked as well about the lights and the siren. It is a mod that I've downloaded through Steam, the workshop. If you guys have it on Steam, I'm pretty sure you guys will be able to have a look and download it. I'm not sure about consoles. Um, I don't know if you guys have access to mods on consoles or not, but... Right, let's turn around here. Try and get a safe gap. That'll do. Cars just destroyed. That's the worst thing about this at the moment is just being on the highway 
Even in the city, cars just change lanes without even indicating. I, I think they need to try and adjust that so they need to indicate for five seconds before they change lanes, not just change lanes on top of you. Oh shit, that was huge. Fuck you off, you idiot. Stay in, stay in your own fucking lane. Bloody hell. That was a huge accident. I think that car or van went up ended then. And normally, I'm pretty sure if that was to happen while you're on call to another scene, you would have to pull over and obviously render first aid and Look at this idiot. Get out of the way. Change lanes, asshole. People just... They don't care. Oh, I know I'm changing lanes here, but Jesus Christ. These guys aren't getting out of the way quick enough. Get out of the way, you drunk asshole. Don't change lanes in front of me. Piss off. Can't you see and hear the siren? Get out of the way. Right. That car over there is smoking like crazy. Right, so we have to do a U-turn here somewhere. Yeah, they need to they need to work on the AI as far as driving goes. They need to get out of the way a bit quicker, but Right, so we need to do a U-turn up here. Looks like it may be in where the service station actually is. So it's a dark red four-door SUV. Right, let's go. We've got a safe gap here. Right, we'll turn our siren off so they don't hear us coming. Our car is destroyed. already be doing a runner so they're in the way station for some stupid reason yeah they are doing a runner we have to chase them down here oh god I hope I get out of here okay right 2GB something I can't read that from here definitely them it's hard to see from here and I can't zoom in until you're actually stopped Alright, let's just keep our lights on. wonder if they'll... It'd be good if they actually pulled into the service station there. The service centre, as you Americans call it, I believe. Check the computer. No open warrant. Oh, the car's reported stolen. There we go. Uh, yeah, so it's a different person. Let's go driver, background check, matches description. I'm you because your vehicle matches a description. How could you even find me in this track? I'm just that good. Please step out of your vehicle and go to the sidewalk. So he's driving a stolen vehicle. He could be drunk as well. All right, talk, ask him for ID and insurance. ID and proof of insurance, please. Sure, officer. Here you go. Oh, and stolen ID. It matches though. I don't know why it hasn't cleared that. Okay, so I'm going to go bang, handcuffing. Um, stolen car, stolen ID. You're under arrest. Are you sure that those are all offenses? Doesn't everybody do them? The stolen car, stolen ID. We're going to go uh, drive it, no insurance. Charge for not carrying valid insurance. Really? That is so much money. We're gonna do a drug. Please cooperate. Oh, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to drug and alcohol test, but can't do that just yet. Stop escorting him here. Let's do a full search. I so I can't do the drug search. and alcohol test once Please you arrest them. I figured we could. I thought we normally could, but right handgun. Also carrying a handgun. You're being arrested. No, don't. Please, officer. I'm going to check the car as well. Let's search this. Right, nothing could be found. I 
something could be found. I'm really, really enjoying this um, highway expansion DLC. Like, it, this is awesome. It's definitely worth the 29 29 90 or whatever it may be in your country. It's definitely worth every cent. I mean, there's a few little fixes they need to do, but other than that, pretty bloody good. 0.75 marijuana. If he's got any more in the front, he'll be charged for that as well. They can have an ounce. Up, oh, done. All right, cool. Tow truck. I have a vehicle here for towing. Can you send a tow truck to my current location? I'm taking you to the police station. Shortly, All right. Well, that was quick. All right, we'll ch chuck this guy in the back, and we'll take him in. Might as well, because we've got to head that way anyway. That shift is just about to finish at 4 p.m. So. Let's cooperate and get into the car. Right. Find out nearest highway station if we can. Uh, all the way up there. Wow, that's a long, long way away. Have to do a U-turn somewhere. Do I need to do a U-turn? No, I oh, know we're right. We're heading heading that way. That's fine. I thought I was gonna have to chuck a U-turn there, but what the? I don't know why I hit that. There was nothing even there. Right, so this is where I'd like to see the ability to come in here and get fuel. Or even do a repair. If we could do a repair from here, that would be pretty cool, I think. Right, no speed limit in here, we can do what we want. Yeah, but I think a um, the ability to do a repair would be awesome. Now that stolen vehicle is not disappearing off the screen. We have found the stolen vehicle though, we've arrested him, we've got it towed, so there's no issues there. Um, we're going to do lights and sirens the whole way, I know we probably shouldn't, but it's the end of our shift, we're going to get this guy taken in. But I feel like they've done a pretty good job. It really is, it is fun, it's way more fun than just playing the base version of Police Sim Patrol Officers, but which is still, which is still awesome and still fun, I still love that version of the game. Ooh, trailer park. Both sides. Oh, roadworks. Um, uh, what's that? That's a diner. But yeah, it's still... The you were taking too long. The vehicle left our radar. I already got it, you idiot. Um, yeah, the game's really good, the base game, but this highway expansion just adds so much more to it. It is really bloody cool. Uh, why the hell... Did you send me this way? Or did I go the wrong way? I think I went the wrong way. Let's just fly up this way. I don't know if there's another station. I don't know, is it? Freaking hell. I don't think there's another station straight ahead. This is where I should be driving on the shoulder. Did they just change lanes in front of me? It's just random. I have to do a U-turn up here, so let's move over. Oop, another accident. Like it matters. Have you seen the front of the car? Right, just under three kilometers. I do love this car though. Really is cool. Shouldn't take us too long to get there. Then we'll end the the day obviously. Have a look at our shift points. We obviously lost a little bit for... I think we lost six points for crashing. I lost seven points for potentially the stolen goods in the back of that truck. What the f... Wish we could turn that off. All I did was bump the bloody thing. Didn't even really do any damage. Yeah, it's been a successful day, I believe, especially that um, way station check. That car was smoking pretty bad. I haven't seen as many broken down cars now. 
which is good. I think they need to limit that and drop that back a little bit. That's been a little bit crazy at times. Right, swing into here. Is there a police station on the other side too? No, something else. This is actually where we started. Perfect. Right, park this thing up. Apologise to the boss inside for the damage. We did get to go to the stolen car prison. returned. We also got the guy arrested. I think, was it stolen car and handgun? Definitely more than one thing, though. I still wish we could not run, but walk twice as fast as this would be great. There must be just like a little lookout over there, like a scenic lookout or something. Right, get this guy inside. Get him taken care of. I wonder if there's still this bug when we go to put him inside the jail Stay cell. Here. No, that wasn't that time. Right, 9.75. Oh, shift points. Report speeders with radar gun. We didn't get any. I probably should spend a whole episode just doing that. Just reporting speeders. Because that's... Especially when it's a bonus like this. It's bloody good points. Not that we really need any extra points. Because we're doing pretty bloody good anyway. We're just about to get our... Our 10th star for Brighton. Which will mean we've got 30 stars overall anyway. So we've got everything. So once again it doesn't actually tell us... Oh, here it goes. Just says unjustified liability reason. So, found illegal item. Yeah, I don't know. No illegal, no illegal, illegal, no. No illegal, no illegal item. But it was stolen handbags. I think that's the issue there. There we go, we got level 10, I believe. Alright, but uh, overall we got... Um, 1,092 district shift points, uh, no partner bonus 195, I haven't really done much online stuff because um, it's been a bit glitchy and a bit laggy and that sort of stuff, but um, righto guys, hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode, I know I had a lot of fun, it was pretty bloody good, I'm definitely enjoying this highway DLC, highway expansion DLC, um, as I said it's due out 18th of June, if you guys haven't added it to your wish list, please do so. And then also pick it up, pre order it, get it ready to go, and then have some fun once it comes out June 18th. But hopefully, you guys did enjoy this episode. If you did, as always, smash that like button. Any ideas, suggestions, as I said, try and help me out. Don't just be an idiot and just say you suck at the game. Let's help each other out. If you got any, if you know something that I don't know or other people don't know, leave it as a suggestion instead of just attacking someone. Anyway, if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed, please do so. It's been pretty. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.